Okay, on the first episode of the Zerg F to C, it's going to be hard not saying F to S. We're going to go over just basic hockeys. Um, I'll go ahead and go over other races as well. So first, Drone's okay, Z for Zergling's okay. O for Overlord, I changed to V. There are some pros that keep it at O, like you can get good with the standard hockeys. It's just most people um, haven't grown up playing Warcraft 2, Warcraft 3, and Starcraft Brood War. So this entire uh, keyboard is utilized in those games. Most people prefer keeping it on the left side. I do keep some things over on the right side. Um, just because I don't like units next to other units in a game say like starcraft 2 you make a single mispress you just made one unit but if you make a mispress in brood war it changes all of those larvae into that unit so if you're wanting to hit something like uh you're you're spamming for select larva and you want to make a hydralisk to make a lurker and Scourge is S. You just made a bunch of Scourge. So uh, that this is a big one. I have it at C. I would like it somewhere else uh, because it's pretty close to V. But I don't mispress it too much because I click V with my index and then I click C with my middle finger. So I don't mispress too often. But it has occurred. I haven't had too much, too many issues. Um, Queen's default. Um, another thing to think about is if you want to go grid, which this would be like QWE, um, that has a little bit of issues with Zerg because we have select larva. And so anything that's underneath select larva is going to be um, like, for example, select larva and grid will be Q and drone would also be Q. So if you're spamming for select larva, what you should do, because there's times where you need to build an overlord at like 16, and you're just waiting for that larva to pop up, and you're just going SV, SV, SV. Um, if you accidentally go QQ, you just made a drone, and now you're at 17, and your overlord's going to be late. So Zerg's kind of difficult like that. Also, this would end up being like W, this would end up being E, this would end up being Z. So if you're like making a bunch of lings and you're going QW, QW, all of a sudden you're pressing your rally button and now your mouse has turned into the rally thing. Or if you're spamming to make an overlord, now you're accidentally built, uh, upgrading burrow. Will you notice it? Probably. Sometimes you might upgrade something you don't like, especially when it gets into layer when you have these upgrades and you're spamming for hydras and you start upgrading uh, ventral sacks on accident. Um, Zerg is a little more finicky when it comes to grid, while Protoss and Terran um, don't have as many issues. And that's just because we have larva and our um, town hall building has a lot of upgrades on it. There's a total of four. Um, I keep build and advanced structure at B and V. Um, if I was starting out new, I would have like build at D, maybe advanced at F, but I just can't do it anymore. Um, yeah, I changed R to burrow and unburrow. Um, some of you might like to do what I do with siege tank, and my siege and unsiege are different, and I just control click those units, and I know which one is which. Um, I usually just don't do it for Zerg just because um, click the wrong one sometimes. I don't know why I don't click the wrong one with Terran though. Um, there is an issue with having Lurker morph at E. It's normally L. Is if you press morph Lurker and Burrow at the same time, you'll lose the money for the Lurkers morphing and then your, your Hydras won't morph, they'll just Burrow. Uh, that's another issue that you could have. It's just I morph lurkers with middle finger and burrow with R. So I usually don't have that issue. I don't think I've ever had it, but it is a glitch that exists. Um, I have patrol at Q 
H is a little bit far. I put move at X because mutas have some micro. Once again, Q, mutas have some micro. Also, patrol, um, it could help you stack lurkers. Uh, haven't changed anything on Defiler. And then upgrades are the same. I'm pretty comfortable pressing M for some reason, but some players might want to move that over to like E. And let's see. Yeah, I just changed Lurker, Morph Lur uh, Lurker aspect to E. Unload is at D rather than U. Mutilus has those still. I don't think I've changed anything on the queen because I don't use it often. Um, okay, so I took this from StarCraft II, like Heart of the Swarm. Nowadays they just have Overlord speed. But I keep this at P just because if I have it at like, uh, if this was at like V by default, this is now my Overlord. If I'm sprint spamming SV, I would accidentally upgrade it. So I make sure these E and P are not units right here either. Um, yeah. And then I have morph into layer and hive at G. It's pretty comfortable to press. It's not a unit underneath here. By default, your layer is going to be hive. When I'm spamming for hydras, I might accidentally make a hive. So I put it at G. Um, yeah, you just got to think about... Uh, your larva, does that overlap with anything? And then does it overlap with your upgrades as well? Um, yeah, that's a little... And then G correlates with Greater Spire. So all of my mutations into a bigger building is the same. I could turn uh, more to Lurker into G too. Um, but I keep it the def uh, E because that's what I'm used to. And it's good for you to experiment and just try out things because my hand shape and what feels good to me is not going to be the same for you. Um, I changed Nidus Canal to C. Some people prefer something on like the home row. So someone might like F and just go F. And then, even though it doesn't correlate with the name, uh, your fingers are likely resting on the home row. But C, I'm a very strong mnemonic kind of learner. So Z for Zergling, D for Drone, H for Hydra, all of that. And then some exceptions with T for Muta, uh, V for Overlord, and C for Scourge, F for Defiler. Um, keep this default. Once again, M is pretty easy for me to press for some reason. A and C. All right. And then I for that. I don't get an opportunity to build too many infestitarians, but I is not a hard key for me to press. Uh, Protoss, I haven't, I changed a little bit, not too much. Um, let's see, that's default. I changed hallucination to C. These are all default. I changed probe to S. It's kind of like Terran's SCV. It's because I press F2, S with my middle finger. So I go like F2 with my middle finger and then S with my ring finger and then middle finger on F3 again, ring finger on S, index on F4, ring finger once again on S. And I just build workers with my uh, hammer hockeys at F2, F3, and F4. I change Templar to T because I usually have my gates on five through zero. It's easier for me to go index on five and then middle finger on E uh, rather than going index, index with five T. Um, I prefer to build things with two fingers um, rather than one finger. Uh, it's always faster to go two fingers. You could uh, tap twice with two fingers quicker than you could double tap with one finger. Um, that's default. Once again, unload is D. 
Carrier has arrived. Interceptor, I put it at uh, C. It is, I did say I is easy for me to press, but in the long run, when you're pressing I a lot, you want it to be over. Like, if M was something that I had to press more than once a game, I would probably change it over to E. But just because it's once per game, I'll, I'll keep it at M. Um, but this is something that you'll be pressing a lot, so I, I kept it over to the left side. And then the upgrades, I don't think I touched too often. I did put Corsair at X, just because it was at O. O didn't feel good to me. And uh, X is like Phoenix in StarCraft 2, I think. And then Terran, I haven't changed much besides Marine at A. You could also put it at E, like Templar. I just like um, M would feel weird because you're moving like your hand, whole hand, and you'll probably go index, index. Or you just put it M at your thumb, and you go like 5M, 6M, and then pressing M with your thumb. But I don't know. I like A. Um, I keep scan at S, and um, I use my 8, 9, and 0 control groups, but if you can, if you're a Terran and you want to, you could probably put it at like P and 0P, 9P, 8P, kind of like how Protoss builds probes, but yeah. I don't think my Terran hotkeys have been changed too much. Besides Siege and Unsiege, and then like Mines at E. Yeah. Alright, thanks for watching this. We'll go over control groups once we start playing.